shots today. How exciting are you getting three eyeball shots? Sure. Three eyeball three. shots, people. Yeah. That's so exciting. Alright, we did it folks. We got her her look, she's got two. Oh, wait, I can't see it. Two. She got two on that side and one on that side. Because that bottle of water, she said it was going to be sore. It'll be alright. By then it won't be. You can go home and ice it. It'll feel make no, it feel I better. So alright, so we successfully got Zoe her shots. She's so happy. But <sighs> now we can go drop off her shower because at school and now she can, can can go to school next week. So that is very, very exciting. That is what we're going to do right now. Talk to you later. Good morning. It is Tuesday morning today. And we have a birthday in the house today. It is my husband's birthday today. Although the day is going to be so busy that I don't even think we're going to celebrate it today. This week is just crazy, crazy busy with back to school stuff. Volleyball has started, which starts today. We have a birthday today and we have a birthday on Thursday. And we're leading up into Labor Day weekend, which we still haven't decided what we're going to do for Labor Day weekend. I think we're just going to stay home. <laughs> All right, so yeah, so my husband's birthday is today, and I don't even know if we're going to um, have time to celebrate it because of all the kid activities and things that are going on. This week is typically always very, very busy because we have two birthdays in our family, um, a day apart. So we always have the birthdays, but then you throw in the back to school events, and then you throw in the volleyball practices, and you throw in kids activities that they've got going on with friends or babysitting. It just, the days fill up super quick, and it's always in like chunk of time, like the mornings are open and then afternoon through evening is just booked solid. So today is no different. Zoe has to babysit this afternoon, and then she has a volleyball practice her for very first practice and then my husband has got things going on for work and then he's got something he's got to do this up this evening for fun but it's on his birthday so I don't know I think we're gonna just go out to lunch today and then we will celebrate tomorrow for his birthday I'm thinking is what's gonna end up happening so other than that you know everything happening you know late afternoon into evening today um, the day is pretty low key other than all the little things we got stacked up in the evening time. So right now Zoe and I are gonna quick do a run out to the store and then I'm gonna try to come back and edit this video that I've been trying to edit all morning but everybody keeps coming in. So my video is late today because I didn't do it last night when I should have done it when the house was quiet but I didn't do it because I was lazy and I wanted to go to bed early. So. I'm hoping to get that video finished up and up here, uploaded in the next hour or so, and then I can start on what I need to get done for the day, which is laundry and a couple projects that I need to film. So that is my plan, and I will see you later. So Emily and I, who is in the seat next to me but does not wish to be shown. <laughs> I'll show this as me. Oh, okay. I have have just had. finished at <laughs> the thrift store and now we're going to head to Dairy Queen to pick up my husband's birthday cake. Then we're going to go home and then I think we're going to go out to lunch, well a late lunch, at Five Guys. So that is the plan, which is a good thing because I'm getting hungry. We may have to get like a little ice cream cone to tide us over. You oh, know what? That's yeah. a good idea. I need to give you three dollars. I don't. I owe you a dollar. No, no, no. I need to give you three dollars. What for? My skull. Oh yes. Blink. Oh, nice and neatly. Yeah, I tried. <laughs> I kind of right. need my skull. Wait, I'm gonna show people it. Um, we are back from Target, obviously, and from the thrift store, and from Dairy Queen, picking up the birthday cake. So I thought I'd show you quickly some seasonal items that we picked up at. Target dollar spot. So Emily picked out this silver or gold skull. I picked up these three little pumpkins. I got three in this green color, one in the white color, and then these are each a dollar. 
And then this, this was also a dollar. It's just like a little, yeah, this was a dollar also. And it's just a little fabric pumpkin. Isn't that cute? This too is cute. Yes, that's also cute. Guys, gonna get us some burgers. No, it. No. It's my burger. And there's my fries over there, but my hubby won't get me having them. Look at that nice origami basket. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> Are you yeah. Going to Goodwill now. Wednesday morning and we have another busy busy day today well not quite as busy as yesterday and not as busy as tomorrow will be but today Zoe has babysitting and then we have a back-to-school night and then we have a birthday celebration for this one what stop oh she don't like to be on camera but that's okay because today we are celebrating her 15th birthday Ooh, She's not happy with me right now, but that's okay. <laughs> Anyways, tomorrow is actually her birthday, but tomorrow our calendar is so filled up with back to school things, babysitting jobs. What else is going on? Oh, volleyball and appointments. There's just no way we're going to be able to do a birthday celebration until like 10 o'clock at night. And we did that last night, so we don't want to do it again today. So. Emily has elected to do her birthday today. So we are going to go out this afternoon and go to Red Robin for her preferred dinner celebration. Then we'll go home and have some cake or something and some presents. So we're very excited because my little baby Emily is turning 15 many, many years ago on this glorious day. This is what I say to my children on their birthday, just to drive them crazy. And it works very, very well. But anyways, so right now, Emily and I, I will not show Emily anymore, because she is hiding behind her head of her scarf, or not her scarf. She's hiding behind, inside her sweatshirt, basically, right now. So anyways, right now, Emily and I are in the parking lot of Michael's, because I have spent the morning kind of like doing a few decorating projects and kind of starting to gather things for my fall decor and I have little mini vignettes kind of started and I needed some more greenery filler kind of plants so that is what I'm here to get and also some paint to paint a few ceramic pumpkins that I picked up at Target I don't know if Emily is going to be buying anything she's just here along for the ride because she likes to go shopping with me right yeah, so that's what we're doing now, and then once we're done here, we are going to stop off at Target, and hopefully they will have a cake that she would like to have, because she is not a cake person. You know, you could do pie, too. You like pumpkin pie? I know, but pumpkin I don't really like. Maybe we should do, like, ice cream sundaes or something like that. No. No? Okay, well, anyways, the thought right now is either a red velvet cake or a cheesecake which are her two favorite desserts so that is what we're going to do after this and then we will go home and I need to do some recording my thrift store Thursday haul for tomorrow and then what else is happening oh and then this afternoon there will be more activities like the back to school night and our birthday dinner so we're gonna go get our shopping done and I will check with you later Hi there, we are back from Target and what else did we go to? Oh, Michael's. Um, so I thought I'd quickly show you just some of the things we picked up. So for Emily's cake, she decided to go with a red velvet cake. It looks like that, it's very cutesy. 
So she got that for her cake. So we've got that ready for later today. <gasps> There's Zoe. And then also at Target, I picked up two little pumpkins from the dollar section. These are a dollar each. So I thought those were super cute. I picked up the green ones the other day because they were all out of white. And today they had two white ones. So I got those. Hello. Have you got your stuff rounded up for back to school night? Um, it's at 3 o'clock, so I'd like to leave at 2.45 to go. Because I want to be there right there at 3. Right on the dock. Okay, okay. I can't find my schedule anywhere. Is it right there? Is it it's right there. Right there? Yeah. Oh my God. Okay, so anyways, the other things I picked up, I went for two more bushes of these plants here. <laughs> Please keep that in. <laughs> they make really good kid swackers. Anyways, keep so... Keep that in. You're being annoying. Anyways, I will put it down so she can't be in. Anyways, I went to get another... I picked up one of these the other day, and then I realized... I think it was last week I picked up a bunch of these, and I'm like, I really like these. And I see a lot of decorating this year with a lot of this greenery stuff instead of, like, your typical... Um, you know, blaze orange leaves and stuff. And I really like the look. So then I'm like, I should go get some more. So I went back and they had the same thing as this, but it was like a darker leaf, like a really dark leaf, green leaf like this. And I'm like, oh no, they don't have it. So then I was like scrounging around and I found these two left. And I was like, score! So I was so excited. I was afraid that I would have to use something else instead. Um, I also thought though, they have some really nice looking like lamb's ear um, greenery, which I thought would look nice with this also, but I didn't pick it up. So if you're interested in thinking about what to use, this would look really nice with the lamb's ear, I think anyways. So anyways, so I picked up two bunches of that, so I should have plenty for what I want to use them for. And then I picked up another little baby pumpkin. These were $5.99 with a 40% off cute, or they were 40% off as were these this week. And then finally, I picked up some paints because I have some ceramic pumpkins that are larger than this that I picked up at Target earlier in the week. And I kind of want to do the same thing as this to it, but I want to do a silver stem instead. So I picked up some metallic silver paint and then I wanted to put, and then they had this too. The folk art paint was buy one, get one 50% off this week. So I picked up this home decor wax by Folk Art. So I'm interested to see how that is going to work. I've never tried that before. And then I also picked up like a satin varnish to go over my pumpkins just to kind of give them a little bit of a gleam like those kind of pumpkins do. So I'll show you the pumpkins real quick. There, those pumpkins right there. So, so that is what I picked up today. And now I need to get myself in the mo get moving because it's already one o'clock and I have to still film tomorrow's video and have some lunch. Hopefully I can get everything done really quickly so I have at least like an hour of downtime today which would be really nice. So that is sort of my plan and I will let you go. Oh look at this mess. Do you see this mess on my hutch? It's like all the stuff that I'm kind of maybe going to use, but I'm not quite sure yet. And, but then here's all my, and then I've got new stuff that I want to use, <laughs> new stuff I want to use, mixed in with all of my stuff that is from spring still. Yeah. I'm just like kind of slowly but surely kind of like doing little bits and pieces of my decorating. Um, just a little little bits at a time. So I don't really have a general theme this year, which I think is very strange because normally I do have some sort of idea of what I'm doing for my fall decor, but this year I just kind of don't. And I'm a little worried that it's not going to look cohesive, but then at the same time, I don't really care if it does, <laughs> if that makes any sense whatsoever. So I don't know. This year <laughs> might be a little sporadic, but we shall see. So anyways, so I'm also working on that, which I want to finish up this weekend. So, <sighs> all right, that was a lot of chatting going on. So I will say goodbye for now, and I will check in with you later. Bye. All right, it is 
almost three o'clock and Zoe is gathering her supplies and it is time to go to the open house and check out where all of her classes are and find her locker and put all of her stuff in her locker. Summer went by too fast. Way too fast. So that is what we are heading out to do now and then after we get back we will go out to our birthday celebration dinner. So we shall see you in a bit. Bye. All right, here we are. She's so excited. I'm going to be like a news person. The paparazzi going back to school for the first time. Are you, how do you feel? Ah. Do you have any words? Some great sucks. <laughs> it hasn't That's even started right, yet. Great. <laughs> great. <laughs> You're silly, man. What about, um, do you know any of your teachers? No. You don't know any of your teachers? No. successfully, Zoe and I anyways, have successfully survived back to school night. It is always stressful, humid, hot, and crowded. But <laughs> we made it. Right, Zoe? So, huh? so we made it through back to school night. <laughs> what? We made it through back to school night, right? Yeah, we did. Yeah, okay. So now, we went home, we picked up the family, and now we are headed to Round Robin for this person's birthday Red. dinner. Red. Red Robin. Red. We are headed for Red Robin for this person's birthday dinner. So everyone's in the car. Emily, do you feel like you're 15 now? No. No? You don't I feel like you're 15? Yeah? That lady just totally <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I think, I think she thought I was talking to her. So you don't feel like you're 13? What? 15. You don't feel like you're 15? No? I, I, I still feel like I'm two. She's still two, folks. So what are you going to get at the store? What? What are you going to get for dinner? I don't know, a burger. Endless glass of beer. What are you hoping to get for birthday presents? What I had on my list. Ah. Uh, you probably should have turned off the air because you probably can't hear anything. I don't have my air on up here. I turned it down. All right, so we will check with you later. Look, Jazzy's even here, but you can't see her because her phone is in her face. Thursday morning and whew, it's only 8 30 in the morning and I have already had a rough day <laughs> my daughter had to work right away this morning she had to be there at like 8 25 or whatever and we woke up at 8 15 thankfully the 
place that she has to go is only like five minutes away. But that was a struggle. And it was like, whoa, roll out of bed and like, oh no, go, 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 go. So that was exciting. <laughs> but anyways, so I know I'm looking pretty rough this morning, but I just wanted to hop on real quickly because the rest of the day, I'm not sure how much I'm actually going to be able to talk to you because today is going to be a doozy. It is Thursday, like I said, and today is actually my daughter's 15th birthday. Although we did most of the celebrating yesterday, I still got to throw in a little bit of birthday stuff for her. Um, and then also the day is just filled with another babysitting drop-off, a doctor's appointment, volleyball, back-to-school events. So it's going to be a crazy, crazy day. And most of the craziness doesn't happen until about 4.30 this afternoon. From 4.30 till about 9.30 tonight. So it's going to be a different day and probably um, a good indicator of how life is going to be. Hey, hey. Shush. A good indicator of how life is going to be once school starts next week. Um, yeah, with all the kid activities and that sort of stuff. So, <laughs> it's going to be an interesting day. But I thought I would hop on real quick and say hello and good morning. And I will check in with you when I can later today. Bye. Hi there. I am at my second drop-off for the day. I'm just waiting for Jasmine to get done with her appointment. And then I can go home and get some lunch and hopefully work on a couple small painting projects or craft projects this afternoon before I have to go do drop off number three for the day. <laughs> so we shall check you later. Hello there. We have just decided to go to Taco Bell for lunch. Myself, Emily, Zoe, and my husband. We just had some delicious tacos and now we're back at home to pick up Zoe's backpack and then we are going to go to the bank and Hobby do Lobby. a Hobby Lobby run. So now we're just waiting on Zoe to come out here. So hopefully maybe I'll show you a little something about of what is in Hobby Lobby today. But then after Hobby Lobby we have to drop Zoe off for her what do you call it? Her babysitting. Alright it is back to school night for my two oldest. Now they are scattering so that I cannot put them on video. Oh, I found one. <laughs> she will not let me show you. Anyways, so we're going to go back to school night for these two. And then we need one more thing to do. And that is volleyball later today. Talk to you later. Hello there. It is Friday and the girls and I have been doing a whole bunch of grocery shopping. We already went to hy -Vee, to Target, Excuse me. and to Aldi, and now we're going to run and get a few things at Costco. <laughs> and today's also September 1st, I'm out of breath because I've been running up and down the stairs. It's also September 1st, and Emily and I are going to start the 100 mile challenge. Basically, we're going to try to walk 100 miles in the month of September. So. <sighs> Our shopping, obviously, is walking around, so that's a good point to it. So we've already gone about a mile, I went, mile and a half. Yeah. You went a mile and a half. Yeah. A mile point seven. Oh, mile point seven. I've only gone a mile, and like point nine. So, I got some catching up to do. But basically, it's like three miles a day. You walk three miles a day, every day of the month. So we're gonna try that. So now we are waiting on JJ. He's gonna come to Costco with us. And we're probably going to pick up some lunch while we're there because none of us have eaten yet today and we are all starving. So, I'll check in with you later. Bye. Well, look at her. She's just like, you know, just laying and I just... <laughs> Why is this so funny? She's just like dead. And she's just <laughs> still hanging on. This is, is my toy. You can't have it. Even if I tickle your stomach? What? Nope. Is that the girl? <laughs> he's like, here. Oh, she's, she's going again. Whoa. <laughs> Let her have it for a minute. Let her have it back to see what she does. 
Oh, she's back.